Alright, so uh, this is something that Roblox did today, and I want to show you what they did, and I'm going to let you decide whether this is biased or not. Pretty much, uh, Roblox made this group called Official Roblox Star Video Creator, and uh, Poke Digger 1's inside it. Pretty much, this is a group that gets you free OBC. Lifetime, pretty much. Um, this is pretty much for the video makers on YouTube that Roblox like, pretty much. Very biased. It's pretty much for big creators that are established on the website that are family friendly and don't clickbait and stuff like that but of course they had to add people that clickbait and people that are inappropriate so let's open poke digger's profile and let's open for staken's profile also known as tofu's profile let's go on the youtube page you know i'm pretty sure this is all family friendly non-clickbait content right giving out free robux every five minutes spawning damn to casita with admin commands right after making Getting verified on Roblox YouTube Star Program. And uh, Dama took a seat to it in English isn't quite family friendly. Let's go on Google Translate. Give me your little thing. What little thing, Roblox? What little thing? And uh, let's go on Tofu's profile. Well, YouTube page. Oh, he did it as well. And uh, there's a big trend of YouTubers clickbaiting down into Casita. And uh, this is what Roblox are promoting. This is what they call quality content that isn't malicious or manipulative in any way. Because I'm sure he actually finds down into Casita. And I'm sure Poke actually finds down into Casita. Or somebody's little thing, as it says in English. The blue guest is back. Um, pretty much his friend that's using admin commands. Probably exploits. And he says that it's a hacker or some crap like that. And uh, Roblox are promoting this. This is what they call good content. This is what they call family friendly content that is great on the website. Benning away my Robux. Total to be paid out 2,500,000. Wait, Wait, but isn't giving away Robux on group funds against the rules, Roblox? I'm pretty sure you banned Landon RB for that, right? Oh, wait, but y y you don't like Landon RB, so you ban him, but you don't ban these guys because they're your golden boys of Roblox. Landon RB is bringing in just as many players, but like, you don't really care. If I lose this bet, I lose 400,000 Robux. Testing Roblox admin commands gone bad with a censored bar. This is what you call family friendly content Roblox, but you don't have all people like Flamingo that do the exact same stuff. Half of these titles look a bit bad, yes, but it's all jokes. 1% of these videos are clickbait, 99% aren't, they're just entertaining videos that are funny and creative. Roblox doesn't actually look at what they're promoting, they just see titles and thumbnails and they pick and choose what they like, and they promote crap like this, like finding Dama to Casita in Jailbreak. It's actually stupid. Let's go on Tofu's page. We found out how to get free Robux items. This is what Roblox are promoting. Like, I have nothing against Tofu or Poke. I mean, I kind of do because they're clickbaiting scum, but uh, the fact Roblox are promoting this. This is how they got the UFO for free in Roblox Jailbreak. Code. Free UFO. You can't put code in Jailbreak, it's clickbait. I don't know, just tell me what you think about this in the comments section. Roblox is clearly very biased, and they ban some people for breaking the rules, and other people they promote for breaking the rules. It's quite interesting, honestly. Like, it really is. That's pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to show you this group. Um, yeah, quite interesting.